Alright, so I'm back inside. Uh, the software uh, that we have right here, uh, I couldn't find it on their official website because um, uh, something uh, they the ch actually they updated the, their um, their page, and uh, I couldn't find the proper driver for the for my A4 Touch KBS26. But I also find it by googling. Uh, right here, the drivers uh, ORG. Uh, I'm going to put it in my description so you can download it if you still want it. And the second thing you have to use this uh, this kind of uh, uh, code right here. There's the IDX6 or depending on the, uh, what it's shown when you open the page. Yeah. So yeah, it's not hard to actually do it. Okay, so I'm like I said, I'm going to show you exactly what the software, uh, how to use it under Windows 10. Uh, it doesn't have any uh, comparable issues uh, using the driver since this driver is uh, from uh, 2000 uh, 2006 era, and uh, but it actually won't do anything. Uh, I mean, it, it can work fine. So let's say I already downloaded the driver. I'm not going to do it again, and uh, I'm going to show you how it's shown here. Okay, so this is the keyboard. Uh, you repeat delay, repeat rate. I can adjust from here. Hardware is see as PS2. Uh, the hotkey. Uh, I can uh, make the configuration uh, hotkeys. I can put it uh, wherever I want. Uh, new Word, Excel, Internet Browser, Email. So if I somehow I uh, I made a mistake, I can uh, I can use the hotkeys to default mode, and we actually uh, put it at uh, default mode, no problem. The scrolling, the uh, navy wheel bar, I can uh, I can set it for the lines, how many lines. Uh, uh, in the pages uh, to be scroll down or up and of course the scroll one page per uh, scroll unit I can use this one too the office keys from F1 to F12 uh, such for the email forward replay all replay and all of, all of that the options I can hide the I key works icon if I want and uh, apply Right here we have the hotkey options, control volume, I zoom in, zoom out, function in Microsoft Office, back and forward as uh, previous document in the Microsoft Office, on screen display, if I want to uh, the screen display to be shown as smaller, as you can see here in, on the monitor, they can be smaller and if I want to increase the size, I can increase it to to bigger as it's seen right here okay you don't have to be worried about the year 2000-2006 you, it will work on Windows 7 no problem another thing with the uh, select the number of seconds on how the hotkey on screen display as I previously, previously said pardon and uh, now we're going to try on Microsoft Explorer in uh, no pardon in uh, Mozilla Firefox that I've been using. So let's say if I want to use for the browser, okay. Let's use this feature. So what I have to do is just activate this feature, Office button. Okay, it's on. And let's see what happens if I'm pressing New. I press new, this is the new file. Uh, let's go uh, to the Word and Excel I haven't installed, I'm sorry for that, but uh, I uh, I didn't have the time to actually install the program. Word, Excel, okay, let's, let's try www and see what happens. Okay, so it works. The email, I can email if I want, I'm pressing the email, connect the Outlook Outlook, pardon okay 
the my computer I can access from here okay the calculator if I want to calculate fast or something I can uh, I I can use uh, this keyboard this this key this button when I press down and it show me the calculator now if I want to use the calendar I'm using the calendar Uh, if I want to search something, I can search. This thing I think it works on the Windows Explorer or Feedback Hub. Here you can uh, summarize your feedback and everything. Yeah, but it's not configured, unfortunately. We have the mute. Okay, mute on, mute off. Okay. Uh, we also have the backwards button that we can we can use. It doesn't do anything. Forward, uh, I have to go to the browser again and see. Okay, let's try right right here. Forward, nothing. Stop and refresh. Refresh works. So it pretty much depending on the page itself and yeah. Anyway, aren't much uh, aren't often use this. Uh, combinations of, key of buttons refresh works fine and the favorites of course so it pops right up and if I want to use for the uh, copy of the files I'm going to show you exactly how it's uh, uh, you can uh, you can be done this way uh, let's erase the this file this folder that I have here on the okay so let's say if I want to to copy something, copy and create a new folder right here. Okay, we have the folder, we have the file. So let's say I'm I'm going to use this. I'm using the buttons right here. Copy, copy, copy the file or the files if are many and paste right here okay as you can see the, f the file is here the wrist rest is very comfortable uh, yeah everything works this is the sleep mode let's say if I want to use the sleep mode okay it passed on sleep mode and the computer is off it's on sleep actually power down uh, power up pardon I just power up my computer and the signal will be uh, by the way this uh, uh, P, uh, P55 UD3 you can power on your computer by using this button from keyboard so if you have this feature you can power on your computer without pressing the button from the case okay so the computer is up yeah so this is how uh, you, ac you can actually use this uh, uh, keyboard for everyday usage uh, if you have any questions um, feel free to ask me uh, please uh, subscribe and thank you for watching. Bye.